John Munson, the self-proclaimed gadabout, originally from Lakeland, Florida, had a set last year. Your sister passed away, but you guys discovered something she had created. We did sort of a bucket list of things that she had wanted to do uh, uh -huh. in her lifetime, and her friends and family have tried to accomplish as many as we could, and number 86 or so is to be a Jeopardy contestant. So wow. good this for one's you. for you. The questions were way harder when I was on the team. So, what you're saying is that you don't have a first place trophy? You're retarded. A retard with the first place trophy. You're for the pineapple upside down pancakes? Hawaiian pancakes. Shake Weight is the flab busting breakthrough that trims your arms and shapes your shoulders at the same time. <laughs> the back of my arm. Definitely in the tricep area. Hey, NASCAR fans. Think you got what it takes to be on Jeopardy? Come on out for the first annual Brain Busters tryouts held at the Hard Rock Casino in Tampa, Florida. On John, are you awake? Dollar application fee, and you yeah. must be at least 21 years of age to apply. There will be live music and entertainment. I found her on your books. Do you want to look at them? Um, just take them to the living room. Thanks. Yeah. Provided by Renegade Workshop. So come on down to the Hard Rock Casino to put your brain to the test. Jeopardy Zone, Brain Buster. Focus, Ben. You're right. You're right. You know, Matt, you're my favorite brother in Christ. Can I have everyone's attention? I'd like to thank all of you for coming today. Unfortunately, we are just taking 1,000 applicants. Oh, come on. I'm sorry. Everyone, everyone beyond this lady, I'm sorry, but we won't be able to give you uh, your applications. Uh, the rest of you, you can just wait patiently. Thank you.
Nervous, son? I'm sure you'll do just fine. Okay, next thing people follow me. First time trying out? Yep. My sixth. I'm feeling pretty good about it this time. Read your dictionary. Mom. Okay, if I could get all of you putting everything down, we'll get started. Dwight D. Eisenhower's daughter's name? Who the fuck would know that? Um, Brian Johnson, uh, Ethel J. Schmidlkoffer, and John Manson. Okay, thank you everyone who didn't make it. Uh, you can st still try your online test. Uh, thanks for coming and please exit through the back. Okay, congratulations to all of you who made it. Uh, we will be in touch any time between now and 18 months. Thanks for coming. 18 months? Don't get so excited, kid. Chances are the bastards won't even call. My name's Jason Flynn, y'all know where I've been. Busting hoes, guts, fucking sluts with a grin. Jason Eugene to the motherfucking Flynn. Chasing my dreams to the motherfucking end. Hey, Flynn, how are you? Check off number 132. Okay, hold on. Are you getting glamour shots right now? Fuck yeah, dude. I've got to see this. I got it covered, man. I'm gonna send you an 8x10 and two wallet sized. Can I get a mosaic? Well, I asked about that. It's like 50 bucks extra, so no go. But I don't think you'll be disappointed when you see these 8x10s. I have no doubts about that. So we're pretty close, right? Yeah, for the most part. I can't believe it. Dude, it's been like over a year. Yeah, there's a lot of obscure stuff on that list, man. No shit, bro. My knee still pops from cheerleader tryouts. Hey, you didn't have to go to prom with Clay Thomas. <laughs> How'd you even find that guy? Shit, you know, talking to him into it was way harder than finding him. <laughs> it was huge on Jeffrey Hill. So they never called, huh? Nope. Shit, dude, that old lady was right. <laughs> that old lady was awesome. There's only a few more weeks left, so I guess she knew. It's cool, man. She'd be proud. Yeah, you know, you're right. I feel yeah, like I a, go. this photographer is kind of weird. I think he's French Canadian. See you, dude. I'm gonna wear my jacket like this tonight. I'm gonna wear my jacket like this tonight. I'm gonna wear my jacket like this tonight. I'm gonna wear my jacket. Hello. May I speak with John Munson, please? This is John. John, hi, this is Linda, calling from Sony Studios. How are ya? I'm great, Linda, how are you? Universal Soldier. What is Universal Soldier? I told you! No way it was Rocky!
Maybe show down in Little Tokyo, but not Rocky. Yeah, you got lucky with that Dolph Lundgren question, little brother. What, are you serious? He was He-Man! If I was on this show, I would have cleared the entire board by now. I would have cracked under the pressure. No way, I'd be awesome. Dressed like a pimp, full-length white mink, or a sparkly ascot. What if you just wrote dick in big capital letters on the podium? Or what if I drew my name like a dick? <laughs> that would be awesome. A self-proclaimed gadabout, originally from Lakeland, Florida, John Munson. Did I hear correctly? John, were you introduced as a self-proclaimed gadabout? Indeed, right? Alex. John Munson, the self-proclaimed gadabout, originally from Lakeland, Florida, had a set last year. Your sister passed away, but you guys discovered something she had created. We did sort of a bucket list of things that she had wanted to do uh, uh -huh. in her lifetime, and her friends and family have tried to accomplish as many as we could, and number 86 or so is to be a Jeopardy contestant. So, wow. good this for one's you. for you. 1965, John. For the band. Right. 1995, Bob went digital when releasing the multimedia CD-ROM titled This Road Interactive. John. What is Highway 61? Correct. Uh, Dylan for 2000. Wow. Bob won an Oscar for his song wow. Things Have Changed, featured in this 2000 Michael Douglas film. John. What is Wonder Boys? Good for you. You're up to $4,600. Wow. Guys, up to 400 please. Milan, Mariner, and Mountaineer are all makes of this auto brand. John. What is Mercury? Yes. Gunsmoke, 800. You know its name is from Spanish for blood. John. What is Sangria? Category is Shakespeare, and here is the proof. Two of the four Shakespeare plays in which ghosts appear on stage. Let's go to Ken Jennings. Let's go to Ken Jennings. 